Guys, that's my hair. It is all off. Look at how long that is. <laughs> so let's see if you guys can guess where we might be going. Are you eating yogurt? Mm. I'm watering our hair so it can grow. And gelling it. And gelling it? Yeah. I really need to get a haircut. It's coming in just a couple days. The back to school haircut. It's so long that I can't keep it down. Yeah. Well, it is definitely the back to school season around here. We are headed back to school shopping with these kids. We need some school supplies and some new shoes because their feet keep growing. So are you guys feeling decisive? A little. I have no idea what that means. <laughs> that means, do you think you're gonna be able to make decisions? Yeah. All right, let's yeah. do it. Do you guys like mechanical pencils? Mm -hmm. So do you prefer regular pencils or mechanical pencils? Mechanical pencils by a little. How that, about this one? That's perfect. You there's, guys love the silly there's scents. There's pineapple and chocolate that are new. Cinnamon. Banana. Banana. That one's gonna be amazing. Our kids are really big fans of the Silly Scents. They have markers and colored pencils and crayons. They just really like it. So these are the boys' favorite water bottles. Since they match, we're gonna have to label them, okay? Okay, got it. It gives you air once. They need to choose a folder. I like this one a lot. You want orange? Okay, yep. Now it's a lot like the Gatorade thing. <laughs> they match like Gatorade. So you each need one three ring binder. Uh -huh. This is Oh, heavy duty. That one. Yeah, you're right. The other size is right there. Is this about the same size as Isaac's? They also need dividers. I really want this to match with my folders. You're feeling orange? I think this is what we need. We just need to make sure it's magnetic. Read the description. Metal frame, dry erase board, premium. Magnetic. Style. You're interested in this one? Yeah, it looks really cool. I like it. That one has three different zipper pockets. So this one has four zippers and you can see in the little pockets. Or there's that one. Which one do you like better? This one. We finally found the sports folders. Thankfully, they don't need new backpacks or new lunch boxes this year, so we get to go get some clothes now. All right, where are you going this morning? To gymnastics. Let's do it. Are gonna get uh, athletic clothes. Own the game. I love it. Completely changed my mind. You like those ones? That's a great look. My boys just love athletic wear. That's all they want to wear all day long. So I told them they could each get one new athletic wear outfit, and then mom gets to pick one outfit too. Isaac found a shirt that he loves and I love. That's a serious win right there. Let's get it. What do you think of this one? It's awesome. What do you like about it? It's a cool color. It has like little socks. Caleb's trying to decide between these t-shirts. Mm. Tough decisions. I'll choose stretch your mind. Stretch your mind. So this little girl just put on her own shoe for the first time. You love shoes, don't you? Moment of truth. That's too big. This one's a little too small. Oh my goodness, you are almost a size four. Yeah, I, I think you could four. totally fit a size four. Put it in the three again, let's see. Oh wow, we have one Yeah, oh my goodness, you keep growing. Then let's check <laughs> Oh my goodness. Oh gosh. 12 is too small too, go up to 13. Put your heel in the back. Oh. What? Caleb, I think you're almost ready for one. Come back to one. Okay, one's a little bit too big, but you are definitely size 13 Let's now. Let's go check on their shoes. Mom, I'm, these are slip-on, no Velcro or tie. And they're size four. Dude, those look awesome. Oh no, what did you find? <laughs> Light-up shoes? Dude, those shoes look sharp. The only problem with them is they're hard to get on. No, your toe's down there. I think that's the right size for you. <laughs> it's always hard with the elastic. Look. They're light up tie shoes. And I don't even have the elastic. 
I don't know about these, Caleb. They're not great for like running shoes just because of the light up. Hmm. So I feel like back to school shopping always starts out fun and ends up with me being stressed. I don't know why it's so stressful. I think it's so many decisions back to back to back. I feel like it's also because I'm trying to balance like what my kids are interested in versus what is more reasonable or cheaper or what I'm interested in. I think it's about time to go home. We found another option for Caleb. That I love and you love and you're okay with. I really loved those other high tops. They're just not gonna be great for playing outside and playing sports. Oh. And it'll get me a lot better at tying shoes. You're right, this would be great practice. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I think those look really cool. Should we get them? Somebody's feeling confident. I did not realize how much these boys have been growing. They both need new athletic shoes. I think we found almost everything we need. Thank you, kind sir. Hey, Caleb, you feeling done shopping? Sort of. No, we haven't gone to the football section yet. Is that a necessary back to school item? Yeah. So the boys are using their own money. They each want to buy a pack of cards. Yeah, you snuck in some dark chocolate. I did. So I'm taking the girls back to school shopping tomorrow. It'll be interesting to see how different it is from taking the boys back to school shopping. So I'm carrying the empty bag into the library and this kid is carrying the heavy bag. I think I'm arriving at like a new stage of parenting where my kids are not only super helpful, like he's gonna be stronger than me in not too long. <laughs> our reward for doing our back to school shopping was to stop by the library. Okay, we left the library with 50 books, two giant bags, books that I put on hold on specific subjects because that's what we're learning about in school this next week. We're doing those subjects because they coincide with a trip that we're going on for the end of August. So let's see if you guys can guess where we might be going. We are going to be studying bridges, earthquakes, the redwood forest, the businesses, Apple, Google, Amazon, and Facebook. That's what we're learning about. So what's your guess? Where do you think we're going on our trip? So all the girls are going to do our haircuts. Except for Janae, of course. <laughs> Here's the before. What are we gonna do, Laura? Cut our hair. I kinda want my hair longer, so I'm just gonna trim it. So I'm feeling scared. Like, actually scared. I haven't cut my hair, like seriously cut it, in four years. And so my hair's been long, but guys, I wear it up all the time, as you know. Like, I never, ever, ever do my hair, and so I think it's time to cut it. I think I'm gonna go shoulder length, but... Oh, I'm scared. I'm worried I'm gonna regret it. You excited? Mm -hmm. A fresh hairdo always feels great. So our friend has a little salon in her basement and so all the girls and I are getting our haircuts today. Haircuts. Hairs cut. Hair. Our, our haircut today. Lucy, have you ever had your hair washed like this? No. <laughs> so fun, huh? Is it too hot or is it all right? I like it. You like it? Yeah. She does her own hair. It's awesome. <laughs> so relaxing. <gasps> Uh, what do you think, Laura? <sighs> what is that? This is stuff that makes it so it has a ton of volume and big hair. <laughs> there it is. It looks so nice, Lise. I like it. You like it? a stadium. That's the bench where the players sit. We have the field and then where all the fans sit with swings and a trampoline for the kids. Obviously. Nice. So is this the bench? You liking that? Yeah. It's relaxing, huh? Her hair's still so fine. Totally. It's still like little baby girl hair. Okay, I still see some blonde in there. Yeah, she still got some. Ooh, that looks so nice. What do you think? I like it. Here's mine. Here's your after. I'm ready to cut it, I think. It's gonna look so cute, Mama. You think so? I think I want it about right here, but that's a lot of hair coming off. <music> Guys, that's my hair. It is all off. Look at how long that is. It looks like a spider. Oh my inside. goodness. 
So you may be wondering why I have this netting down back here. So I've been having an ongoing problem that some animal are pulling up my grass every night. If that continues, they're gonna kill all of our sod out here. You know, I'll keep you up to date on my battle against the squirrels and raccoons to save the grass. <laughs> here's the after haircuts. It's bright out here. Oh, <laughs> bless you. So here's the after of my haircut. She said it's a really great versatile length that I can do loose curls or I can straighten it. I'm feeling still, I guess maybe a little bit in shock. Guys, that is short. That is super duper short. I can still put in a ponytail, which is what matters for when I work out. Um, but I think it's just a change and change is not super easy for me. Okay, well I'm home and this is gonna definitely take some adjusting. I'm feeling a little bit sad inside. Like, what did I do? Why did I, I cut off it. my hair? It looks so good. Jeremy likes it, so I that's do. good. I really like it. Anyway, it's a big change, huh? And what do you think, Caleb? You look good, but not normal. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. You don't look normal. Okay. I was like behind you, like, give a thumbs up, be happy. <laughs> I haven't trained them yet. I think I am gonna like it, but at the moment, I'm feeling a little bit of regret. Like, why did I chop off all of my hair? But I've had it long for so long, I really just wanted to try something different, and I never do my hair. So I'm hoping that with my hair being shorter, it won't be so time consuming to do, and maybe I'll do it more often. The good news is, Jeremy really likes it, and he was super supportive about it. I think that you are unsure of your decision every time you cut it short, and then you end up liking it a week or four later. So I think that's what will happen. You've been around the block a few times with this? I was actually watching some videos of when your hair used to be short and I was like, I really like it like that. So I really like it. I think okay. it's good. So it smells like nail polish from the right here. Yes. And even little Nene okay. has her nails yeah, done. Yeah, you did your nails. Do you want this color? Mm -hmm. This morning, Caleb decided to add batteries to this not annoying toy. I'm really grateful about that. So we've been hearing a lot of meowing today. It's been really fun. So we have some friends joining us for dinner tonight, but before they get here, we need to fold all of this. <laughs> Family folding party! Nene's <laughs> been dancing the whole time! <laughs> well, we had fun with our friends for dinner. Now the kids are having a little dessert snack before getting ready for bed. Rages on. Good night. JSL. My name is Sahana. I'm from New Jersey and I'm reading Heroes of Olympics. I think um, Isaac would really like this book. My name is James and I'm reading The Hunger Games. I really like this book because it has to do with the character changing over time. My name is Angie and I'm from Texas and my favorite book is Drums, Girls, and Dangerous Pie. I really like this book because it's like really funny and there's like a loving side of it. Jay House out! Good job! <laughs>